Well, what I experience when I'm doing a reading, um, it, it sort of changed through the years. When I was much younger, um, I actually saw s the spirits standing in the room. It may sound very frightening, but at the time, to me, it wasn't. I mean, they were actually... I want to say they looked like solid people, but they weren't really solid. They, there was something like... You know when you look at one of those pictures when you're in, in grade school, what's wrong with this picture? Well, there was definitely something wrong with them because you can kind of see through them or they were glowing. But, but by all rights, they kind of look like human people or animals in the room. Um, now that I'm older, I don't see them in the room anymore. I see them in my head. It's like a movie screen. And... Um, Actually, I have to say, except for the animals, sometimes the animals' spirits still float above the head of the people who come to me, which is kind of cool, and it's actually quite beautiful. So right now, it's more of a, uh, it's like seeing a movie in my head. Sometimes it's like a slide projector. It happens really fast. Um, often, when this, when, when logic plays in, into my head, which happens now and then, I often wonder, am I just stark raven mad? You know, because what am I seeing? But then names come out. And then, like, I'll tell a woman, like, oh, you have a cocker spaniel at home. She's like, yes, how do you know? I'm like, well, I see it in my head. The animal doesn't have to be dead for it to come through, or the name of, you know, the children, or the name of people. Um, sometimes it's too spe specific, and it sort of um, it surprises me even.